Now, from the guard position, I'm moving into the technique that we just did, the arm wrap arm bar. Sometimes it's hard to catch this arm. Maybe their arm is bent a little bit, and this, I, don't, I just don't feel like I can get it. One thing I can do is if my opponent has a gi, I can find there's usually a chunk of gi hanging out right there. See, there's that chunk right there. And I'll grab it, and then I'll squeeze here, and my left hand, the one that's underneath his arm, is catching his collar, and this one's here, and I make the gi choke. If I show from the other angle, I'm doing the arm wrap arm bar. I've got him here. So now, in this position, from here, if I can't get the arm, or I feel like it's going to be challenging to get the arm, I already have the side of his neck trapped pretty good with his collar right here. So that's cutting off the artery on that side of the neck. Now I'll take this hand, and I'll reach here, grab a chunk of gi, and make the choke. Sometimes if the gi is kind of loose, I could bring my thumb up on this side and hold it like this. Now I'm just hugging him. Now, as he starts to posture up and he's moving, I bring my arm around, keeping the grip, and I make the same choke. Another, another way to do that same choke. I'm going to show from this side. So I could take my thumb, put it up here, hold him down. Now I'm just holding him, right? He starts to posture up. I bring my hand around without changing my grip. Now look at where this choke is. That's a really good choke from the arm wrap arm bar.